This is a science project in Gaza High School where we aim at creating affordable teaching resources for biological sciences using ICT. We are now going to take you through a practical lesson of dissecting a cow's eye. This is the cow's eye which we are going to dissect. This is the cornea, this is the part, and this is where the optic nerve is found but cannot be seen at this point. We now cut off the part. Since the part is slippery, an incision is made with it with a blade. Then scissors are used to cut through it and eventually cut it off. After the fat has been removed, the optic nerve can be seen. When cutting the fat, care should be taken not to damage the nerve. The nerve transmits impulses to the brain from the retina. At this point, the fat has been completely removed. We are now going to remove the cornea. We create an opening in the cornea using a pin. The cornea is hard and tough because it has a protective function. You may need to also use a blade to cut through. The aqueous humor oozes out as you cut around the cornea. It is the colorless liquid and it keeps the cornea in shape. Carefully cut around the cornea to avoid damage of the inner tissues of the eye. Due to its toughness, it takes time to cut. Using forceps, hold the cornea and continue cutting. The forceps enable easy handling during the cutting. Eventually, using the forceps, remove the cornea from the eye. Now we cut through the sclera, which is a tough tissue that is a protective covering. We cut through it to see the inner parts of the eye and it requires scissors to cut it. This is the vitreous humor, which is jelly-like and keeps the eyeball in shape. This is the iris, which adjusts the size of the pupil to control the amount of light entering the eye. This is the pupil. This is the vitreous humor, which is a jelly-like tissue. This is the suspensory ligament, which is the black tissue. And this is the lens. The suspensory ligament stretches and relaxes the lens in order to focus far and nearby objects. We are now going to remove the lens to see its magnification power. We can now see the lens magnifying the text. This is the retina gathered from the back of the eye. And here is the blind spot. This is the tape term found underneath the retina. And here is the optic nerve clearly seen.